<clears throat> okay, how you all doing? Quick, short video on this. The uh, T-Bar Flammer. Uh, it's pretty easy to make. 10 mil pipe, copper or steel will do it. Yeah, so the Flammer. Uh, easy to... You need a series of belts. A belt long enough to go around your chest to attach it. The measurements are here uh, on the previous one. You need to make the belt going through the uh, lead one a bit longer. The reason for that is it goes underneath your hand on the grip of the club. Uh, T-bar piece across. And all we did was we used uh, the best way to attach this on is through the belt with cable ties. That way, the cable ties have movement three, you know, through the actual bar itself, so it gives you movement. And uh, reinforce the cable ties so they're not digging into you with some duct tape. Duct tape the belt going through the end there as well. Make sure the belt's leather because it needs to be quite strong. And that's all you need. Uh, the thinner the belt, the better, because it's going underneath your hand on the grip of the club. And as you can see, when you get to the top, all that is is the belt goes through, it goes round it, and it goes back down on itself. But you can cable tie the ends on there and use duct tape to strengthen that pivot point. And then the belt that goes around your chest goes underneath the two... Uh, cable ties so that it's held in place nice and tight and that part there obviously goes round your chest attaches it so that you can then use that as a pivot thanks for watching